Hello guys, we are back with our next lecture. In this lecture, let us go through the next question. Okay, so this question belongs to Gate CSE 2015 Set 1, guys. The given question is consider the following relational tables. Okay, and they are saying execute the query, and they are asking what how many rows will be re resulted at the end. Okay, so the the query is select yes dot student name. So basically, what is yes here? So this table is nothing but yes. This table is nothing but p. Okay, so we are trying to find the student names yes dot student name so basically we are trying to print these names comma sum of a marks okay so p dot marks so we are trying to combine them okay so let us start combining them okay so this result is how much guys so one value the result is a 8 plus 7 okay so it is a 15 so it will be 150 so when it comes to 2 the 2 is having two exams he wrote like max and physics so the sum is how much guys 75 plus 65 so it is a 75 plus 65 the result is 140 similarly 80 plus 80 is 160 okay so i have combined them and from student yes and performance p where yes dot roll number is equals to p dot roll number group by student name okay okay so here there is an issue so whenever we are performing group by student name if you observe here two names are raj guys and one name is rohit so if you observe here carefully, so once we combine, what will be the issue guys? So once we combine indirectly this Raj, both Rajas will, we assume them as a single person, right? Yes. So once you group them, you are going to get Raj as one name and the other name is Rohit. Okay. So if you try to collect their data now, so indirectly at the end we want to print their marks, right? So Raj is nothing but one and three indirectly. So what is the total of 1 that is 150 plus 160 okay so that is with respect to 310 so 310 will be the Raj value and the Rohit value will be 140 right yes so now the question is that only right so they are asking how much will be the values of that particular students with respect to their marks so Raj will have 310 marks and Rohit will have 140 marks and they are asking how many entries will be the result so there are only two entries so 2 is the correct answer got it yes so this question is really a bit funny right because whenever we are grouping them by names so two people have become only one people guys right yes and he got more marks right yes okay so i hope everyone got a clear idea with respect to this question so in the next lecture let us continue with the next question okay yes so let us meet the next lecture thank you thanks for watching like share and subscribe for more awesome videos like this thank you